Where I lived, I lived on college where they have the tennis court now. Mm -hmm. And we were the only black children that lived in that block. There was some um, few white kids lived down the streets, which we all played together. And across the street, and when Urban Renewal came in, they were all gone, except we were the only ones left. And so back in 1967, my dad had our family home built on McCoy, still part of the neck. Well, I was 13 when my mom passed away. She passed away on March the 3rd and buried her on March the 6th, which was my birthday. My dad um, worked for the City of Independence Street Department. I helped my dad with the kids. I cooked, did laundry, and my aunt and my grandma, they worked with my dad. There was a big old lot across the street from where I lived. It was huge. So we would gather, play ball, or there was another big lot over near them. We all played together. We were all like family. We were like this. We bonded. We didn't have a choice at the time. Roxanne, Angela, Nancy, Ricky, we're all kin in some fashion. And we just had a ball. I mean, when I was in school, there was a few kids that kind of blew us off, you know what I'm saying? And um, I think it was stupid. It was stupid. 